Hello YouTubers and welcome to Destination LEGO and welcome to another LEGO City review. So today we have from the LEGO City the Police Pursuit. This is set number 4437. This is for ages 5 to 12. Comes with a piece count of 129 pieces. And it retails here in the UK currently for £12.99. That's from the LEGO Store or the LEGO Store Online. Okay, YouTubers, so let's take a first look at this set now. Okay, so there's our first look at this set. So this set comes with two minifigures, um, being the robber and the forest policeman. Comes with two vehicles, which is the robber's off-road vehicle and the forest policeman's uh, ATV or quad bike. Um, accessories with the set are the crowbar which you can see there to the right of the robber minifigure and to the left of the robber minifigure there there is a uh, $100 bill um, and a gold bullion bar okay so let's take a look at those minifigures right so there we can see our robber um, you can see him holding his crowbar there. At the top of his head he has that grey beanie on. Um, obviously you can see the print, print into the front torso there to represent the robber in his uh, prison top stroke uniform there. Um, in front of him to the left and right you can see the $100 bill and that gold bullion bar. Um, the $100 bill is a printed tile piece. And looking at the right side of our robber there. You can see that crowbar there in a bit more detail. And the rear shot of our robber, and you can see again there that kind of prison uniform look going on. And you can see he's got a tear there to the rear of that uniform too. And that left hand view. And back round to the front, but this time without that crowbar. There we can see our rubber with his beanie hat off, so you can take a better look there at that face printing. It is just a single sided printed face. Okay guys, so that's the review of our rubber complete. Okay, next up we have our forest policeman. So first of all taking a look at that front view there whilst he is wearing that helmet. And we can see there that printing to the front of the torso. And the visor obviously can be raised and lowered. And then with the helmet off. And the rear view of our forest policeman. You can see that rear torso printing. And he's got his radio there tucked inside his pants. And you can see the cable going up over his shoulder. And that will obviously be a earpiece. And back round to the front, so you can see there that face printing is a single sided face. Um, you can see him there with his cool glasses on, looking pretty cool. So that's our forest policeman. Okay, so next up we have our first vehicle. This is the police ATV or quad bike. So there we can see that shot there. Just going to spin this around for you guys. And we can see that front view. I'm just going to tip that up while we're there. And you can see that police... Oh, apologies. You can see that police sign at the front there. That is actually a printed tile. So there's no stickers in this set. So that's great. No sticker to apply. So that police is printed. Okay, just carrying on around. Okay, there we go guys, and it is a pretty basic build, um, but there we go, that is the Police ATV. Okay, and there we get to see our forest policeman obviously sitting and riding his Police ATV. Okay, so next up we have our robber's getaway vehicle, this off-road vehicle, obviously a large 4x4 off-road vehicle. So again, I'm just going to spin this round so you can get a look at all angles. 
front shot there. So to point out here, you can see up here we have kind of a row of lights, which should obviously be used for night time. Um, obviously a lot of these vehicles are used in the United States, um, probably used out in the likes of hunting, etc. So big row of beaming lights up the top of there. And finally looking in from the rear and while we're on that shot uh, to point out this part here it does open up it's on a hinge so that's the boot area or the trunk I'll just tip that forward for you see there is quite a bit of space in there and while we've got that open what the robber is obviously going to put in um, the back of the truck to obviously make do with his getaway is going to be the hundred dollar bill the gold bullion bar and his crowbar so they just simply drop into that boot area put the gold bullion in and finally the crowbar and shut that boot area back down okay so as with most of these lego vehicles or lego city vehicles the way to get our minifigure inside the truck is to remove the roof and that just simply um, comes off very very easily like so um, and again if i tilt that up there you can now see inside you can see that seating area and the steering wheel there in the center so again pretty basic Obviously we can put our minifigure seated in there, which I will do for you now. Okay, so there we can now see the minifigure robber sat in his getaway vehicle. Um, obviously with the roof off at the moment, so you can get a better look inside there. So you can see plenty of room in there for him. Um, and again, just simply slot that roof back into position like so, very, very easily. Um, and obviously there now we can see again our robber inside that vehicle making his getaway from the forest policeman. So there we go, there's my review of this set complete and I have to say in particular I do like the off-road vehicle. I think it's quite a good size actually. Kind of, um, difficult to kind of show really because I'm obviously an adult with um, I don't know, medium sized hand I guess. I quite like it. it's quite a chunky design for that off-road vehicle um, anyway guys like I said that's my review complete so to recap this is set 4437 from the city Lego city range so this is the police pursuit hopefully you did enjoy this video guys if you did please do go ahead and give it a big thumbs up for me um, comments feedback questions as always welcomed down in that comments section and if you haven't done so already please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel and I look forward to seeing you all in the next video Cheers.